Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. We Syarif Kairuddin, Adib Azri, Ahmad Daniel and Munawar Shah from Section 1 of Class Operating System are doing a video about the sleeping bubbles problem. The sleeping bubbles problem is a commonly a common problem related in operating system where uh, deadlock and starvations occur. The, in this video, the bubble which represents the processor and the customer is, re is representing as the processors. In a normal bubble shop, the bubble will sleep when there's no customers. And when a customer walks in, he sees the bubble sleeping. So he says, Hey, wake up! Come away, come away! Let's go cut some hair. The customer sits down and the bubble cuts his hair. Meanwhile, the bubble is cutting the first customer's hair. A new customer will walk in and see the bubble cutting hair. So he will wait at the waiting chair while waiting for the first customer to finish. And in the meantime, new customer will walk in and wait as well. Wait, 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 wait. <coughs> while, wait while everyone is waiting, a fifth customer will enter and sees that the waiting queue is full. So he decides he'll come back later and leaves the bubble shop. And when the barber cuts the first customer's hair, and when he is done, the customer leaves without paying. The second customer will come in and the barber will cut his hair. And the third customer will sit to the next queue. And then when everything goes well, he will continue on until every customer has finished cutting their hair. The barber will realize that there is no more customers in the shop and he'll be really, really, really happy to go back to sleep. And then the bubble will continue sleeping. In a case where the bubble is cutting a customer's hair and there's only one waiting seat left, then two customers walk in at the same time. You'll notice that there's only one seat left and they both want the same seat. This is what you call a deadlock, where two processors want one the same resources. In another scenario where the barber takes a really long time to cut the first customer's hair, starvation may happen to customer number two, where he may not move forward and nor backwards, this causing him to starve in his waiting seat. The solutions to the problems mentioned earlier, there are many possible solutions available. The key element of each is a mutex. What is a mutex? Mutex, or also known as mutual exclusion in computer science, refers to the requirement of inquiring that no two concurrent processes are in their critical section at the same time. It is a basic requirement in concurrency control to prevent race conditions. So there should be no two similar products, uh, there, there, there should be no similar processes, two current concurrent processes in the critical session at the same time. Critical section and here means that period when the process access a shared resource when the two processes access a shared resource such as a shared memory so getting back to the scenario the bubble must require this mutual exclusion before checking for customer and release it when he begins either to sleep or cut hair a customer must acquire it before entering the shop and release it once he is sitting in either a waiting room or otherwise known also a waiting queue or the barber chair and also when he leaves the shop because no seats were available he should also release this eliminates both of the problems mentioned in the previous section. Yes! Oh my god!